Think Python and Excel can just do statistical analysis and run forecasts? Well, you will not believe how easily and quickly it can create complex charts that can automate any month-end presentation you throw at it. Now, if you're following along in the doc, go down to code number two. We're going to want to start by the import numpy as npy, and we're going to go all the way down to right before prompt number three. All right, and we're going to stop again at plt.show. So we're going to go back to b2 again. We're going to do equals py. We'll paste in our code, and then we will hit control enter to run it. Now, just like before, it's going to give us the py image. We'll right click, and we'll go ahead and expand this with display plot over cells. Wow, and look at that, in just seconds we got two entire charts. Now what I asked it to do in this code was again with dummy data to look at product mix for our coffee shop. So in the top one, you'll see product mix over time and how each type of product mix is changing. You'll see we're getting a little bit more in seasonal, so clearly this was kind of around that Halloween time frame, you know, pumpkin spice lattes. Um, aside from that, you can see all the fluctuations and then a little bit of a change as we get towards the end of the year. And down here, you'll see the impact of the product mix on gross margin. We can expand this down and make sure we can see everything. And there's all of our months and how the gross margin is changing. So we'll see that we actually do a little bit better as we get into the seasonal time frame. So this seasonal bump actually helps our gross margin. Now, again, we're working with dummy data, but look how fast that was two entire charts that would probably take you 30 minutes to get to this level of formatting in Excel, set up to automatically update. And now again, once we connect it to our data, it's gonna be incredibly powerful.